welcome to chemistry world today our topic is methods of separation for length analysis so the first uh, so the first method is precipitate as we already know that according to fejans method when we move from left to right in a period the covalent character increases it means that cerium hydroxide is strong base as compared to lutetium hydroxide because it make more strong covalent bond with oh so it is difficult for lutetium to release oh as compared to cerium hydroxide which form weak covalent bond with oh3 hydroxide so it is a strong base because it can easily donate oh to any acid and in water so the weakest base luoh3 which has lowest solubility product precipitated first it has lowest solubility product so it precipitate first and laoh3 has the highest solubility product it is lowest solubility product ye bahut mushkil se dissolve hota hai kisi bhi cheez ke andar kyun kyunki ye weak based hai aur iska jo covalent character hai wo bahut zyada high hai according to fejans rule and ye strong base hai isliye ye highest solubility product attain karta hai एंड ईजीली जो है डिजोल्व हो जाता है सो ये इजीली डिजोल्व नहीं होता इस वजह से इसके प्रेसिपिटेट पहले बन जाते हैं प्रेसिपिटेट फर्स्ट और ये प्रेसिपिटेट लास्ट प्रेसिपिटेट लास्ट इसके प्रेसिपिटेट लास्ट में बनते हैं सो so, इस तरीके से हम लेंथनाइड्स uh, को एक दूसरे से सेपरेट कर सकते हैं so our second method is fractional crystallization so in fractional crystallization fractional crystallization lutetium plus 3 ions jo hain unki solubility लोवेस्ट थी जैसे हमने पहले डिस्कस किया लोवेस्ट सोलिबिलिटी सो दे क्रिस्टलाइज फर्स्ट सो दे क्रिस्टलाइज फर्स्ट एंड सीरियम थ्री प्लस हैज हाईली हाईएस्ट सोलिबिलिटी सॉरी हाईएस्ट सोलिबिलिटी सो it crystallize out at last to crystallize last so our third method is complex formation so our third method is complex formation so what is complex formation complex formation mein first of all hum ek complex banate hain by using reagent जो कि कॉम्प्लेक्स बना सके सो so, इस काम को करने के लिए हम ई का इस्तेमाल करते हैं ई डी सो हम किसी भी लेंथनाइड को एक्वस फॉर्म में रिएक्ट करवाते हैं ई डी टी ए से वट इज़ ई डी टी ए इथाइलिन डायमाइन टेट्रा एसिटिक एसिड इथाइलिन डायमाइन टेट्रा एसिटिक एसिड सो इस केस में हमारे पास जो सीरियम ई डी बनता है सीरियम का कॉम्प्लेक्स ई डी के साथ सीरियम ई डी टी ए कॉम्प्लेक्स ई डी टी ए स्टैंड फॉर इथाइलिन डायमाइन टेट्राइसिटिक एसिड वो अनस्टेबल होता है अनस्टेबल और जो ल्यूटिशियम ई डी बनता है ल्यूटिशियम ई डी कॉम्प्लेक्स वो होता है स्टेबल एज कम्पेयर टू सीरियम ई डी कॉम्प्लेक्स सो वैन वी वॉश आउट विद 
when we wash out with oxalic acid <laughs> oxalic acid because it is unstable so it broken out easily so it broken out easily as compared to lutetium edta complex which is stable so it can't broken out easily it can't broken out easily so in this way we can separate the small size lutetium or small size with high equivalent character lanthanides from large size less equivalent character lanthanides so our fourth method is is ion exchange method fourth method is ion exchange method ion exchange method so in this method we have to take lanthanum ion lanthanum 3 plus ion and react it with resin which contain 3h 3h resin in a test tube containing cooh group so the reaction goes and we get lanthanide resin 3 plus h2 so in this case lutetium lutetium is small and has great equivalent character so lutetium is small so it highly hydrated so highly hydrated and lanthanum or cerium is small or oh, is large in size cerium is large as compared to lutetium so low hydrated as compared to lutetium so hydrated lutetium is bigger than lanthanum or cerium hydrated hydrated lutetium is bigger in size hydrated lutetium is bigger than cerium hydrated so we can uh, understand by hydrated cerium and hydrated lutetium hydrated uh, cerium is closely bond closely bond because its size is small because its size is small in the case of hydrated cerium and hydrated lutetium is weakly bond in case of hydrated lutetium so when we wash out with cerate ammonium salt cerate citrate ammonium salt we get lutetium first because of weakly bonded we get lutetium plus ion first then cerium so in that case we can differentiate we can differentiate these lanthanides by these four methods and now the fifth method is thermal decomposition of their oxy salts thermal decomposition of their oxy salts thermal decomposition of oxy salts
when we increase the size of lanthanides for example when we move from right to left in a period the thermal decomposition of their oxy salt increase the thermal decomposition of their oxy salt increase for more convenience thermal decomposition of oxy salt increases when the size decreases when the size decreases means when we move from left to right in a period or when the atomic number increases or size decreases in lanthanides so cerium no3 is uh, weakly decomposable as compared to lutetium no3 so in that case we got lu yeah means lutetium first then cerium so in uh, this method we can distinguish between the and uh, lanthanides and separate them easily if you like this video share subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon thanks